Hello, Pepsi, wherever you are. I wish you so much babe, so much warmth, so much love, light, happiness, joy, abundance, and so much faith. Real quick, can you do me a favor? Can you hit that like button? Please hit share if you like to share, and please hit subscribe and turn that notification bell on so you all so you can always be updated whenever I put another message out there for you guys. And if you like to do me, I mean, I have to, it's not a requirement, but it is truly appreciated. The information is in the description box down below. And thank you from the bottom up with all my heart ahead of time to anybody and everybody who chooses to do so. And for the super thanks as well. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, may God bless you, beautiful souls, sinful. And guys, make sure you are subscribed and make sure you have that notification bell on to you all. Because I'm going to be doing, um, next week I'm going to be doing a giveaway. So, but it's for subscribers only. So make sure you are subscribed and you have that notification bell on so you do not miss it. Alright guys? Alright, let's see what's going on here. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, and Angel Passed Away. Oh, okay. Um, you, whatever you're doing, you're a spiritual leader. You use your gifts for the good, alright? And you're about to be, like, or maybe you already are. Maybe you started a, you recently started a, um, or maybe it doesn't even have to be recent. Maybe you've been doing this, okay? Um, something with your spiritual gifts and, like, you, you started your own business or something or your own channel or something. And you're being seen as this beautiful spiritual leader, um, that you are and you're like you know god is our boss please not forget that but like um in the 3d like you're your own boss like you don't you're having people either work for you or you're working solo well in the 3d we have you of course we have um god jesus angels and ancestors and everything's passed away that uh you know that surround us but yeah you're you're like you earned this spot that you have you're on your throne you're sitting pretty you're handsome and you have your you know you're on your throne with your with your beautiful crown on it can't be stolen. It can't be taken. I like it. I love it. Yeah. You earned your spot. I just heard you earned it. So uh, very gracefully, too. And it got these people but hurt. Yeah. There's somebody. There's it could be a father figure or uncle or a masculine energy or a workplace that we have four four that's holding on to something that belongs to you. It could be your work. Somebody could be like holding on it could be a father figure or uncle figure or a masculine energy um with a child or it could just it could be a workplace somebody somebody is holding on to something that belongs to you i'm certainly getting there's an old workplace that you used to work for that stole something from you that's holding on to it you're getting this back you're going to find out about this and somebody's st like stealing some of your creative ideas or something that you do for work so if you have a channel they may be stealing your um your content that's that's coming out, so, <gasps> excuse me, confirmation, yeah, chaos, destruction, or people, mayhem, to this father figure, this uncle, or whoever, or this workplace, whatever this is, yeah, well, what do you expect, and they steal, especially, like, they're stealing some, like, not only are they stealing something from somebody, but they're stealing it from a divine being, somebody that's in their purpose, that's doing God's work, and not smart, homie, not smart at all, not smart at all, that's why it's very important, guys, for everybody to get into their purpose. Because, you know, once you're in your purpose, especially, it's like instant karma. And you start to get, you know what I mean? Once you get in your throne and, like, you get in your purpose and you, you, you're you doing, you pass all your tests. Oh, somebody's going to be passing away just in the death corridor. Um, it could be a father figure, an uncle figure. Yeah. Alright, so they're, um... You know what I mean? Like, you're, when they're in your purpose and they're doing, like, yeah, of course, it's going to be, like, like the whole initiation process, you know, to make sure that you're, you don't, you know, you want to go through a bunch of tests and, you know, make sure that you still continue to show up and, um, you know, that you don't get tricked out of your spot. But I'm strongly getting you past that spot. You you past your initiation. You know, you are the spiritual leader. You are extremely gifted and you're, you know what I mean? You, you earned your spot. And it's completely chaos, destruction of people, mayhem to whoever stole whatever whatever their goals were to come up to steal a house, possibly. This group called Common Secret Society or something like that. I don't fucking know. Whatever they did, they, they were getting it back, okay? So, because you earned your spot, alright? You're on your throne. You know, you keep showing up. You don't want to let nobody or anything affect you. And you're doing it so gracefully and angelically. Always your time to your angels and ancestors. Away. What does the collective need to know? Thank you. Yeah, because you're in your purpose, like I said. You're in your purpose. Love it. You're exposing these people. You're getting a generous blessing coming your way. Um, because you're in your purpose. You keep showing up. You're not allowing anybody to um 
to stop you, block you, or they're evil. Of course, there's so many evil in you. It could be with Taurus. It doesn't have to be, but or you could be a Taurus. But you're about to get this generous blessing. It's a major blessing from God. It, you're gonna be able to bless the pockets of other people. You earned it. You deserve it. It's coming through your purpose. It's gonna be able to give you this passion that you've been giving. Because of course, you got people spying on you, watching you, working you. But everything's being balanced out. Okay, if you're getting good luck and karma, good luck, good fortune, good karma. You're gonna be working together with people. Somebody wants to apologize because of they're under some sort of spiritual attack um because they're caught up they realize you're the one with power not them fucking losers <laughs> they feel like they're like living on the edge um and the, the cliff is like about to it's like crashing right beneath them and they know it they know it somebody could have a white dog or just a, a dog in general oh spirit lines thank you they're unable to heal from this they're doing black magic or something they're unable to heal they worship something very dark, okay? They're, they're, they're little basement dwellers, you know what I mean? They're only able to be a Libra. Yeah, because of whatever they invested in. They invested in coming up against somebody that's in their purpose. They're attacking, you know, they're attacking you and your purpose. They're evil in your purpose. They're also attacking it. Well, not, they're doing some sort of black magic on your purpose. But guess what? You're in your purpose. You're doing God's work. So they're not attacking you. They're attacking God. They're not attacking your work. They're attacking God's work because you're doing what God sent you here to do. Not very fucking smart now, is it? No. But whatever seeds you're planting, they're, they're, they're flourishing beautifully. Of course, you have somebody that's smiling in your face, stabbing you in the back because they know, they know that you're getting, your seeds are flourishing beautifully. They know your shits are coming in. They got these people in grief, pain, sorrow, agony because you're moving away. You're coming out of rough waters into smooth sailing and you're protected and your, and your move is protected as well because God's moving you. You're move, you know what I mean? This is like you, God's moving you. You're in your purpose. You're doing, you know, you're doing God's work. So congratulations, guys. Um, and keep these people from your past. Keep your sword up. Anybody that God had you cut off, it's very important for you to keep your sword up against these people, okay? Someone's name could be Derek. Someone's name could be Carr. Because I just thought of Derek Carr. Because Derek Carr, the, the quarterback for the, um, for the, I was about to say Oakland, <laughs> for the um, Vegas, you know, for the, for the Raiders. His name, his number is, is four. So, um, he's my, you know, I love Raiders. He's my favorite quarterback, too. But, um, yeah, he, what do you call it? You know, someone's name, you know, first, middle, or last name could be Derek or Carr, could be someone's last name. This could be your name or somebody involved, or it could be somebody, or someone could like the Raiders. Somebody, you know, somebody have beautiful blue eyes. Like, you know, he has very beautiful blue eyes. This could be you or somebody involved. Or pass on loved one. Yeah, you're manifesting. Okay, this is black magic they're doing. They're doing black magic on your purpose. But you're manifesting your, your new beginning. This black magic you're not going to be able to heal from. It's going to re it's return to sender. You're manifesting yourself to be your, into this queen of pentacles energy. If you're not already. And it got these people. Your ex, definitely. They're, they're, um, they can't sleep at night. They're like boohoo crying about this. They're evil eyeing your happiness. They're evil eyeing your union. You're about to be coming into union. Alright. Um, and your ex has definitely been exposed. You're getting victory, success, public recognition, possibly even fame. And somebody's getting locked up, all right, for all these illusions that they cast and all this black magic they've done and everything else they did to you. Um, and, you know what I mean? Ever since you walked away from them, they've been doing it. It's There's something that's very significant about a Pisces and a Scorpio. You could be either a Pisces or a Scorpio, or there's like a Pisces and a Scorpio. Something about a Pisces and a Scorpio in the Leo. But, um, yeah, you walked away from these people, and ever since you walked away, they've been doing a lot, okay? They've been doing a lot, casting a lot of illusions, but it's a completion, it's the end of a cycle, they know this, and they're nervous now, because you got somebody coming in to protect you, somebody in power from all these lies, manipulation, and all the secrets, all the betrayals, and they're losing on opportunities, they're scared, they're getting kicked out, because a source of truth has come out about how they tried to block you, and why you cut these people off. Hey, and what their plans were, and you're planning your whole new beginning because all, all your hard work is paying off because you're about to get this ace of pentacles. Something about an ending. Somebody might have passed away. I don't know. <laughs> Fucking losers. <laughs> oh, yeah, these people from your past. These people from your past that are doing some sort of black magic or in, your, in their purpose, not smart, could be a Scorpio. Or you could be a Scorpio. I feel like there's a Libra and a Scorpio, a, me a feminine Libra and a masculine Scorpio that's in that scene, this, this, you know, evolves with other people. And I'm picking up on a, a, fem a feminine Aquarius as well. And, um, and a, Le and a, um, and a, what do you call it? And, a, um, a Leo. 
that's been uh, evil and making of you, and possibly a Sagittarius as well. They're getting that's doing this black this black magic is going to return to sender. Return to sender. Sorry, but it's not sorry. Always your advice to angels and ancestors will need to pass through and what is the collective need to know what they need to be aware of at this time. Please thank you. Thank you, Jane. Thank you, Jane. Thank you. Yeah, you're heavily protected. We okay, we got the uh, oh shit. Yeah, these people from your past, we have six, ooh, we have, look, yeah, there's six, six, and then seven, seven. There's these people from your past that, that ended up having, like, a major fall. They could have stole something from you or something, or but they're just having, and they were, they're in complete ruin. They lost out on something, like, you know, they're pride of riches. They're in debt, you know, um, um, what do you call it? They're very selfish. They're very unfair in what they did to you, very unjust what they did to you. Okay, they're going through major chaos, destruction of people mayhem. We have seven seven. You're protected from this black magic. We have the seven. My left, my right ears are ringing. Somebody's talking hell of shit about you. But um, yeah, they're doing what they're they are they're. Blah, 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 blah. Can I speak? Somebody can stutter because I don't stutter, but I just say right there. That could be an indicator. Um, but they're yeah yeah six you know six nine. If you do it this way, someone's tell oh six nine like six nine the rapper. Someone's telling on these people. Someone's doing sex magic on you as well. It's not working. It's somebody from your past. But they're complete, you know, ruined. They're they're taken because they're in pride of riches. They stole something from you. I already know they're trying to do some sort of manipulation, some sort of black magic on your purpose. Which, like I said, you're in your purpose. They're doing God's work. So they're not attacking you. They're attacking God. So this is major chaos, destruction of people, mayhem. Like, the, the, the tower in the upright is just fucking, it's very bad. It's like a transformation there, but... You know, when in the rebirth, it is extremely, like, they're complete ruin, complete ruin. The problem, but, like, you know, especially when it goes from the six of, um, pentacles in the rebirth, followed by the seven, I mean, by, followed by the, um, the tower in the rebirth, that's major, like, they're in complete, complete ruin. Their whole world is, is come tumbling down. They're living, like, hell on earth. And it's because of them attacking you and your purpose. They're doing black magic on your purpose. But you're way too protected. So guys, let's please do not forget. You're protected from this dumbass Leo too. Guys, Leos are very, very good people. But this Leo, you know who I'm talking about. The Leo that just constantly keeps attacking you. Their energy is not as bad as it was. But still, um, it might be this Leo that's starting to protect you now. Because they're going through such chaos, destruction of people and mayhem. Um, who are attacking you, they got the idea, they, you know, they got the fucking, the memo, you are not to be messed with, um, because whenever they attack you, um, you know what I mean, they, it's, it's just complete chaos for them, they didn't realize you're this powerful, either you're ascendant master and car reincarnated, you have ascendant master, master, um, surrounding you at all times, you have God, Jesus, angels, and ancestors who almost passed away, surrounding you at all fucking times, okay, and, um, look at ours, our six, six, seven, seven, okay, also, um, let's not forget that you have God, Jesus, angels, ancestors, and loved ones that passed away. The utmost love, respect, gratitude, and appreciation for all that they do in our lives, okay? Because they're protecting us from some, whatever they, these idiots conjured up, it was something extremely dark, okay? It was very, very dark, but we were, you know, you might not have felt any effects from it at all because you're so protected. But, um, you might have maybe been sleeping a little bit more, more than you normally do. It's because you've been fighting in the spirit, okay? It's because you've been healing from whatever this black magic was, whatever they sent you that you're protected from. So it's return to center. They're going through major, like, major, manip like, major, 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 major chaos, structure for mayhem. It's definitely a Leo, double Leo. Or you could be a Leo. No, there's a Leo that's under heavy judgment. It's that karmic ass um, Leo. You could be a Leo too, but like, and again, Leos are very good people. They're very good. They're very creative. They're very kind. Usually, you know, they're usually, you know, very good people. But this is a, just a very karmic Leo that's been bullied as a child and they take it. They don't have many friends. Um, they don't get the, they, they, they're attention whores. They always need the attention and they, they look at it as like negative attention is better than no attention. You know what I mean? And they don't like all the attention you get. So, and they, but they, yet yeah, it's so weird, but they, but they want all of your attention. You cut this person off and they've been going, it's like a little child going through a, a temper tantrum because you took their toy from them. You know what I mean? Like, because it was bedtime and they couldn't have their toy no more. You know what I mean? And they're just having like, a, like, and they're over tired. You know what I'm saying? You know, like when they're like two years old, like the terrible twos, which I think is like a fun time, but you know, I think, I mean, um, 
but you know how like the kids are and, and they're just really overtired and they're just real cranky because you take the toy from them because it's bedtime and they're already overtired it's like that it's exactly what this you know this it's like a big baby they're they very well could be they're like it could even be like a senior citizen at this at this time like they're older they could be at least 50 if not older um and they're just acting like a fucking two year old all right uh that's going through a temper tantrum they're under heavy judgment okay you're way too powerful way too strong you're way too protective okay they're under heavy heavy judgment they're being watched by the fetty wops they're also spying on you they're getting in trouble for some sort of illegal um stalking and spyware or whatever they're excessively stalking you and um they're in your phone you have your devices and like you have something either in your phone or your home they could have cameras in your house or they have spyware in your phone this person could have like somehow they they're they're good with technology or they have somebody that's like an IT tech or something or so, so they 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 know about it. they play like they don't know as much as they do oh they do they know a lot more than what they what they know what they what they let on because they they play like they don't because they don't want you to think that it's them that's in their it's in your phone the cops know about this the authorities know about this about their gang stalking about their spyware about something with illegal cameras or something. Um, they drive by your house at night. They're very fucking creepy. This person's a really creepy body that's entitled with a lot of grease. All right, they're being watched. They're watching you celebrating too. They're trying to steal. They're also being watched celebrating when they stole something from you or they thought they did some sort of blessing. Um, you're getting some sort of quick communication about this. It could have been some sort of creative idea for fertile idea. They, they, they could be stealing. And I'm strongly getting, like I said, they're in your phone or they have cameras in your house. They could have been recording you and your, your boyfriend or girlfriend or you and your ex, um, doing intimate things. And they, they were doing like, you know, they were possibly putting it up on the internet and selling it or they were, or they had like a fake account pretending to be you and they're, they're making money off of it. You're getting some sort of information about this, okay? They worked with your ex in the past too to to cause you chaos, destruction, or something like confirmation. To call they they're the reason too. They they got into your ex's head. They made up a bunch of lies about you to to your ex and to cause you problems because they wanted all your attention. They wanted ultimate wish fulfillment. They ain't getting it. You are. You're getting your ultimate wish fulfillment and this inheritance that was stolen from you because you're getting justice. This is part of your justice. You're getting the best possible outcome when it comes to this justice when it comes to this court case about this inheritance and it got these people in deep emotional pain because it's a painful permanent ending okay you're going to be getting a message about this all right holy spirit blind spirit angels ancestors and the past so what is the collective need to know what do you need to be aware of at this time please be right here Somebody's very smart, like Elon Musk smart, like, well, maybe not that smart, you know, Elon Musk is extremely fucking intelligent, but, like, somebody's very, like, very smart, especially with, like, phones and stuff, like, IT, like, smart, you know, like, how, like, Elon Musk is very, very, because, like, Mars right here is sticking out to me, and it, where it says Mars right here, and then whenever I think of Mars, I think of um, Elon Musk, you know, because now he's make, creating life on Mars, um, so somebody's, like, very intelligent when it comes to, um, when it comes to, like technology and somebody's getting caught up with a um, cell phone jammer as well they have a cell phone jammer and that's how they turn like your cameras off like if you have cameras at your house they would they were coming into your home and shit too they were turning they're blocking they were doing it was um they have like cell phone jammers it's, they have, it's very illegal too um and, and it was too it's to, to so when they when you were at home they would come like maybe you're at work or something they were coming into your house doing illegal shit something about sniffing your panties as well um <laughs> what the fuck I'm just seeing somebody ew guys when it's doing something so creepy ew this creeps me out so bad one of my favorite dresses la 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 like I because I usually in the summer I always wear a dress I love dresses I usually have a dress on every single day even sometimes in winter but it was so fucking creepy this it's i had this really cute black dress and actually one of the cards it looks like i have things on here and it looks ill i showed this person who i used to call my uncle um it was so creepy i went in my closet 
you know, because I had all my dresses hanging up in my closet, and I, it literally looked like a face, there was a black mark, somebody took my dress, they were in my fucking house, took my dress, and was waffling in my smell, like, they're smelling my dress, you could see their, the imprint of their face, like, their face must have been all sweaty, they're probably all messed up when they fucking did it, it was so creepy, where's this at, it looks like this dress, it looks just like this dress, I love it, well, it's a little bit different, but I love that dress too, I don't fucking wear it anymore. It was one of my favorite ones, too, but it literally has the imprint. Like, it looks someone, someone's, like, you can see their whole face. And I showed this person, it's funny because he did a video, too. And I showed him, I was like, dude, look how fucking creepy this is. And I thought it was uh, my neighbor. Um, and I, But when I, when I showed this person that I used to call my family member, his face turned bright red. And I was like, what the fuck? Why your face turned? Like, is it you, you fucking creep? Let me check my cameras right here it's kind of a dress like this but not really but literally on the back of it there you can see the eyes and like the mouth but it's actually it's, it looks something like this it's actually a lot different than this but it's it's actually a lot cuter than this but on like you can see like it was so creepy and you could just see someone just took their took my dress and like put it in their face and like were sniffing it it was so fucking creepy and his face turned bright red i was like ew like that's, I was like, dude, that's fucking creepy. And he was like, well, yeah, if it's not on a girl, it is. No, it's, it's, what, what? And his face was bright red. And I was like, ew, why the fuck? Was it you, homie? He's the one that used to take me to do laundry, too. And he used to steal my shit all the time, too. He used to steal my fucking underwear and my socks. It's weird. Whatever. And, like, I call you uncle. Like, that's, you're creepy, homie. Like, what the fuck? But whatever. Anyway, yeah, you are protected. Your stardom is protected. Somebody's trying to do. <laughs> somebody's obsessed with you and your stardom. They're trying to do some sort of like black magic or whatever. But you're protected. The devil's even protecting you and your stardom. No, that does not mean you work with the devil. Let's get that very abundantly clear. You do not work with the devil. The devil is protecting you though. Okay. You have God, Jesus, angels, ancestors, all these passed away protecting you, but you also have the dark and the light protecting you. That does not mean that you work with the devil, okay? Not at all. It just means that God's having the devil protect you and, and some of these people. And you have some sort of move. Your your forward movement is protected as well. You are you're gonna be moving. Someone's trying to stop and block your forward movement, but you're extremely protected. You're protected in every area and aspect of your life, right? Your ships are coming in and it got this these people in grief, pain, sorrow, agony because they can't stop this, they can't block this. You're strongly getting somebody's trying to do some sort of destiny swap type of thing. Could definitely be an Aquarius. An Aquarius feminine stole something very that like uh, something very valuable that belongs to you it could be an inheritance or something she worked together with the fucking scorpio and the, um and the leo to do this there's a lot of energies actually involved in this whole situation but they're fucking looser okay how did i can get about the bath the graves <laughs> i'm gonna give a what to do just give it away for me <laughs> let me stop playing <laughs> on some real shit though you're manifesting, <laughs> keep your eyes on your goals, because whatever goals you have, they're protected, okay, you have the page of wands here, and you're manifesting your, your goals coming in, okay, and it's protected, all right, 72 could be significant, 77 could be significant, 66 or 69 could be significant, yeah, you're getting some sort of quick communication coming in, about what they stole from you, you're gonna have reason to celebrate, because they're being watched, they're under heavy judgment. This Leo, you're very powerful, you're very strong, and you're getting ultimate wish fulfillment because they're under heavy judgment for all the chaos they caused in your life. Motherfucking lose this. 87 could be significant. Let me get 87 right here. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, when was it passed away? What is the collective need to know? What do they need to be aware of at this time? Please and thank you. Yeah, we have the, the, these people from your past, 23 could be significant, um, these people from your past, they wanted you to be nervous, they're very evil-minded, very cruel, very, um, careless, you know, individuals, that they're, they wanted you to doubt whatever you're going on, whatever you got going on, we have one, two, three, you're going up, you're elevating, um, but they wanted you to, they wanted you to doubt yourself, they wanted you to be nervous about whatever goals you have, make you think that, you know, you're, whatever you're doing is not the right thing, it's, it's whatever black magic they're doing, you know, you're not nervous, you know what the hell you got going on, you know what you're doing, you know what you're supposed to be doing, and you're doing everything amazing, okay, they wanted you to be nervous about some sort of move, 
maybe you moved, but it's protected and you're protected. You're protected from all these people in the devilish energy and whatever their childish obsessions are. Weird ass obsessions, actually. Great mother lessons. Great mother lessons for the most of all the days. <laughs> Fucking weird days, are you? The three of pentacles in the reverse followed by the the page of swords in the reverse followed by the hangman they're caught okay these people that were working together to come up against you in your past they're not working with each other no more okay they're very low quality people um you know they have like they're very they, they steal your creative ideas and stuff because they have no fucking they have lack of um skills okay they they they're very reckless and they don't they, you know they don't ever want to do it. They don't ever do anything right. They don't have their own creative ideas, okay? So they're definitely trying to steal some sort of, some some of your creativity or your fertility. This is why they do underhanded shit. Well, they're unable to spy on you anymore because they're caught. 23 is definitely significant. We have 23 here. We have 3, 3, and then 23 again. You are a definitely a send -up master reincarnated, okay? They're unable to spy on you anymore. Somebody's arrested or or maybe they maybe you move. And they're butthurt because they can't spy on you. They're caught, though, for spying on you. They were trying to sacrifice you and trying to get you to, like, to sacrifice your purpose. To try to get you to be nervous. They wanted you to walk away. They were doing some stupid childish shit. They were sending some sort of tax to your, um, your purpose. Like, they were, they were hiding behind fake accounts, leaving nasty reviews, nasty comments, the, um, so that they, you know what I mean? So they're hoping that you would walk away, but you're way too strong and powerful for that. You know, you know what I mean? Just like how you have people coming against you, you have people even protecting you. Um, like you could even say if you have a platform, you could even have followers, like you know, like some of your 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 subscribers, like that are that are even going off on these people, and they're that pisses them off when they see that. Like whenever they leave a nasty comment, and when your subscribers, and thank you by oh, by the way. I absolutely, like, I have the best subscribers in the world. I absolutely love you guys. <laughs> Obviously, some of you going ham on some people when they leave nasty ass monk. <laughs> and I, I truly appreciate you guys. Thank you. God bless your beautiful souls. <laughs> Especially the one, um, she's always going off on somebody. <laughs> I absolutely love you guys. <laughs> Thank you for that. <laughs> but, like, yeah, that gets them super mad whenever they do that and they try to, like, they, you either just, you don't, you totally ignore them or even, like, your own subscribers or your own, like, whatever you got going on. Whatever it is that you're doing, they'll be like going back. They'll, you know, they'll even yell at people for you, and they get so butthurt about that because they can't get nobody to. They realize their black magic ain't shit. They realize that they ain't shit, and like they can't. Whatever they're doing is not causing. It's only causing them chaos, destruction, and people mayhem. Because you're in your purpose. You're helping many people around the world. All right, and you're doing it so genuinely, so authentically, so pure heartedly, and straight from the heart. You know, so purely with pure intentions. Well, these people are doing everything all negative. Now they're starting to, they're getting in trouble too, okay? They don't, they're not, they don't want to work with these people no more because they see that they're caught up, all right? And they're also getting in trouble for gang stalking you, cyberbullying you, um, and stalking you. Like, this is, this is some sort of creep out if they're caught up to this. Invading your privacy. Yeah, it's a completion's end of a cycle because you walked away from these people and you're progressing rapidly. And because you walked away and you're keeping your sword up, you know, they're they're getting arrested for whatever, you know, whatever um childish antics that they have sent your way. You're the one that's getting this victory, success, power, recognition, possibly even fame. And because you walked away from these people and you're keeping your sword up, you're rapidly <laughs> excuse me, um, confirmation, you're rapidly progressing, okay, and you're getting many opportunities coming your way that you're going to get the victories, the success, the public recognition, possibly even fame for it. So keep showing up, keep doing whatever you're doing, okay, and keep doing it so authentically, so genuinely. Um, you definitely have somebody wanting the shit out of you and your happiness. But it's your, definitely your ex that's like, you know, butthurt about your happiness, your joy. They see that ever since you walked away from them, ever since you cut them off, you, you're like the, you know, the rise of the phoenix. You're coming, you know what I mean? You had a huge transformation. And it's because they're the ones that were the problem. They were the ones that were, you know, causing you all this chaos, destruction, all people and mayhem in your life. We have 333. Three, three. 23 is definitely significant. 
And we have another three right here. Three, 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 three. 33, someone's a 33 degree Mason. This could be somebody that's like the group that of people that were coming up against you. Somebody could be a 33 or 32 degree Mason. Yeah, they wanted you to, they wanted you to, they're trying to manifest you to walk away from your purpose and walk away from your goals. It's not happening. Okay, they're caught up to doing this too. They're trying to sacrifice you and trying to get you to sacrifice your purpose. They're trying to block you. No, they're not. You're, you're, you know, you're, these people from your past are blocked and there's somebody you still have to cut off that's trying to snake their way back in, but they're not, you know, that's not happening. Maybe they tried to reach out to you. There's definitely something about 32 and 33 degree masons. And something about 23. So there's something significant about 23 for sure. Because we have 23. We have 23. 23. 23. 23 is definitely very much so significant. Someone's name could be Bill. Billy. Will. Willie. William. Williams. Willard. Hey, Willard. Willer, is that you? <laughs> Fucking loser. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, guys. <laughs> but there's all I'm saying is about a fucking a Bill, Billy, Bill, William. Or Willer. Something like that. But they're trying to block you, okay? These people from your past, it's because you cut them off and you've been, you walked away. Alright, they're trying to get, they've been attacking you. They're, you're protected from these people. Don't worry, alright? They're fucking losers. Keep your guard up, yeah. And because they're trying to block this solid love over coming in where you're gonna be, you know, overflowing with love. Um, it's it's like it's ace of cups, it's can't be stolen, can't be taken, it's from it's a gift from God. They're heavily burdened about this and because they're going to prison and you you have your sword up against these people. Why? Because they're trying to frame you. They're fucking butthurt because you have your sword up, you have them blocked, you're not allowing them back in to finish their job. This is definitely your ex that worked together with other people, other karmic friends and family that um to come up against you. They're planning to set you up to frame you so they can steal your they can steal whatever from you. Um, don't allow these people back in, okay? They're not coming back, okay? Do not let them somebody could have got kicked out, they could have tried to reach out to you. This could be an ex or something. They're coming in with a false ass cup of love, okay? The good thing you either ignored them or you kept them on red. You either kept them on red or you just blocked them or you just, you know what I mean? You just told them to fuck off. Keep it that way because they're only coming in because they're trying to finish the job. All right? So anybody you cut off, it's very, very important right now for you to make sure you keep them cut off. Do not allow them back in your life, please. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. You bought this nasty ass little hoe. Um, and whatever attack they try to send you, they sent you some sort of attack like in your sleep. They wanted you, you know, in your head and like on uh, um, doubting yourself, okay? They wanted you they were some sort of attack, some black magic in your sleep. Alright, it was supposed to cause you some sort of chaos, destruction, of people and mayhem in your life, but it didn't work. You were too protected from this. It was some sort of night of night of attack, whatever. It was this Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. Very um cold hearted, like cutthroat, do anything for money except for work for it, you know what I mean? Though they get their money very underhandedly. We have two, three, four. Yeah, you're protected from this, okay? It's very moody, very foolish, very jealous, very naggy, very um materialistic. Everything's like, you know, you know, it's all about money with this wench. They're not working with her no more because they know the truth now about what they were doing. What she was trying to do to you. We have nine nine. Now, now, yeah, this spiritual warfare that they sent out to you, they want to apologize because everything's being balanced out. And you're you're getting good luck and good karma. They're getting bad karma, okay? And it's coming back to them. What are they sent to you? You're too protected from. So, it's not, again, it's not forget the gift. God, Jesus, angels, ancestors, loved ones that passed away. The utmost love, respect, gratitude, and appreciation for all that they did in our lives. All right? Because they, you know, whatever this was, is something very, I don't think she's going to be able to, whoever sent this, I feel like it's her. We're going to spend a lot of money to do this. 
they're not going to be able to heal from this. Four spirit, five spirit, angels, ancestors, long in the past. What is the collective meaning now? Yeah, everything that says eight swords truth and one million percent eight swords truth has come out about everything. About what the about everything that they did, about all the mani manipulation, all the lies, all the betrayals, and what their goals were to come up against you. And everybody sees you in your in your purpose that you are the one million percent eight swords truth. They're trying to attack your crown chakra. It's not working. You're protected. Your crown chakra your crown chakra is is um protected. All right. You're having some sort of breakthrough coming in, okay? Some um you know, some great ideas that's protected. It's coming in from whatever your goals are. You're manifesting this. It's going to get you out of this Five of Pentacles energy. If you are in it, you're coming out of it, okay? It's a, you're going to get some sort of, like, breakthrough, amazing idea coming to you um, in whatever you're doing in your goals, okay? It's, it's a gift from God, okay? It's the, like your ancestors are going to be, they're giving you downloads, some sort of downloads. You're getting more spiritual downloads. They were trying to steal these downloads, okay? They were doing something in your sleep. They're trying to ash project you. They're trying to get into your Akashi records. It's not working. They're dumb. They might have even got in. They thought, like, you know what I mean? Thought that they got away with it. No, they didn't. Your ancestors were like, what the fuck's going on here? Yeah, it's a completion. It's the end of a cycle because of 1 million percent eight swords truth has come out. And these people are now starting to walk away because they, they're the ones that see that you are the one in power, not them. Guys, um, please do me a favor. We're going to get that, those likes up, please. Can we hit that like button, please? Please hit them likes up. Please and thank you. Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, and look, we have one, two, three, four. Okay. Damn, yeah, they were very unjust what they did to you. This lying piece of crap went to the authorities. They lied to, or, um, to the authorities. She's a very pathological liar, okay? she Everything she says is a lie. Very nasty, cutthroat, you know, cold hearted pathological habitual liar okay she wakes up tells a lie tells a lie you know lies all throughout the day she doesn't even know like she'll if she doesn't even go by her actual name she goes by like different names probably something similar to, to yours because she wants to be you she's a fucking weirdo but um she went to the justice system and she was very unjust what she did to you for her she worked with people from your past an ex of yours and family members and lied to the justice system about you to steal whatever she stole from you or attempted to steal or whatever she was trying to block from you. The one million percent eight source truth has come out about this. You're getting this justice. Yeah, now she, they're losing out opportunities because they're being fucking lied. Evil bitch. Yeah, now she wants to apologize because she knows that you look. Now she wants to have two, two, two. She even look and see she wants to apologize because her plans to get you caught up is it didn't work. She's caught. She wants to apologize. We have the, the two the page of cups and the two of wands in the reverse. All of her plans all has come all of her plans, what she was planning to do to you, has come out where her goals were to like you're protected from this. Alright, the one million percent eight truth has come out. So now she wants to apologize because she's caught up and she's being watched by the police. And we're spying on you, having spyware on your phone, you have cameras in your house and gang stalking you and everything else. Fucking losers. Yeah, dude, she's going to prison for sure. Eight of eight of swords. Dumbass. She could be in jail right now. Or she's about to. They're heavily burdened because they're they know they're getting locked up. They're in a mental prison right now. They're heavily burdened because they know they're going to prison for all the illusions and that they, they casted. And you're the one getting this victory, success, thought, recognition, possibly even fame. This could be your ex, or they know that you're getting this victory coming in when you're coming into union with your divine counterpart and you're truly happy. You're getting a solid love offer and something about a home and a foundation. Yeah, as a spiritual because you're a spiritual leader, you're in your purpose, doing what you're supposed to be doing, and you're passing all your tests with flying with flying colors. We have two, 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 two. Look at all these. Look, so you're surrounded by angels at all times. And look at all these angelic numbers. Two, two, two. One, four, two. There's still 23 all over the place. So 23 is definitely significant here. Two, 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 two. And two. Actually, yeah, two, 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 two. And if you add one plus one, that's another two. So two. So two, 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 
two, because if you add two shit together, it's two, two, two. Beautiful. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, and Ones that passed away. What does the collective need you? What do they need you to be aware of? Yeah, it's your dumbass ex or a couple that lied to you the fucking justice system about you. They're trying to block this union, but it's not happening. They're the ones doing this black magic. The justice system knows about everything. All their plans, what they were planning to do to you, um, they failed. They failed every single test. Yeah, because you're a spiritual leader, you're extremely gifted. They're trying to block your gifts. You, um, your downloads are trying to steal your downloads. It's not happening. You're way too protected. She's also lying on you. She's telling people that you're a fraud, but everybody sees that she's the fraud. And she went to the justice system, right? She tried to use your gifts, whatever your, your spiritual gifts are, against you. That was a big mistake because when she did this, when, or when, when she did this or they did this, they were very stupid because... Um, the justice system started watching you. Say if you have a channel, whatever you do, you don't have to have a channel, but whatever you do with your spiritual gifts, but either way, you were under investigation, right? There were, because she lied to the justice system about you. And your gifts actually helped the um the, the justice system out. You like how you cracked your own case. I'm strongly getting that. Yeah, they want to come invest in you. Whatever you're investing in is flourishing beautifully. You got somebody smiling in your face stabbing you in the back, but it's alright. Because they know that your ships are coming in. They're in grief, pain, sorrow, agony. Because they know they're going to prison. And you're getting your justice. Um, Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, the ones passed away. What is the outcome? Can you give me an idea? She sold her soul to the devil, dude. You're getting some sort of payout, okay? From her. You're going to sue her. You're going to sue her and anybody she worked together with to get you locked up in whatever she was trying to do. Now they want to apologize. They might be trying to come... Be very careful. We have 23 again, guys. 23 is so significant. It's insane. But they, because they want to come and try and pay you off or bribe you because, like, they're, you know, they're afraid because of what maybe St. Angel's true that's come out. So they're going to try to bribe you to, to shut you up. But don't do, uh, take this bribe, okay? Or they're going to try to apologize and give you some sort of, like, I don't know. If you do have a platform, they might be trying to come. They might try to, like, balance out the scales because they know well, they have to give you back whatever was stolen from you, too. So you're getting that one million percent sort of the ace sort of truth that's come out about all of this. But I feel like they're also to try to cover. They know they can't heal from this black magic they sent you. So they're trying to balance out the scales. So whatever um, they spend a lot of money on this black magic too. Somebody sold their soul to the devil though. They try to sacrifice you. They want to apologize about that too because they know that the devil's coming to collect their soul. You're single, self-sufficient, independent, whatever you do for your work. And again, there's something about, there's some work that somebody stole from you or, or something that this workplace or this father figure, this uncle, that was a lot of money. And that was working with this really cool coffee secret society. There's a house that was involved. They stole a house. She stole a house, possibly. The justice system has a house, possibly. Now they could have got kicked out of this house. What's the outcome, please, Thank you, sir. Yeah, they're losing out on opportunities because why? The one million percent ace was true that's come out. Somebody lost the job. She could have worked for the justice system. She either was, she's either a dirty, um, she's a crooked cop or she's th that, this is that paid informant. She's losing out on her job. Death. Damn. 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 We have death to the ten of to the ten of cups to the moon. Double Pisces, okay? You could be a Pisces. Some about Scorpio or Pisces here. Or somebody in Bach could be a Pisces. They're they're losing on opportunities, okay? Um it's a complete ending of something here. If someone's family or or a karmic family about all the lies, the betrayals, what they've done to you, and, um and how they abuse their power, they realize you're the one in power, not them, and what they did to steal this money. This inheritance or whatever you said they stole from you. It was a lot of money. Whatever was taken was a lot. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. You're getting it back though. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, 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 that's what. What is the outcome of the situation? Please, thank you. Thank you. You're coming into union too. She also lied. Your ex, definitely. Part of your justice is too. Your, your, your divine counterpart could be a, a cancer or you could be a cancer. Or your ex might be passing away from cancer. I'm strongly getting your, your, your ex is um, sick. They're very ill. 
they're not telling you this, they might have like colon cancer or something. It's because they're actually, um, never mind, I'm not saying that part. But we have another two, two, two. You're coming into union. Someone's name could be Brian. Or O'Brien. Could be someone's last name. This could be your name or somebody involved in the situation or a past one, loved one. Yeah, you're coming, you're, you're getting somebody coming in to protect you, this is like your divine, you're coming into union, they're going to protect you, also this lying bitch you worked with, your people from your past, your ex, and everything else, to come up against you, to, they lied to your, your ex also lied to the, um, justice system about you as well, because they all work together to seal whatever this is, you're going to, you got somebody coming in to protect you, and you're going to get some sort of quick communication about what they stole from you, it's coming back to you, you're going to have a reason to celebrate, because they're, because they're going to have a reason to celebrate it. Because they're being watched by like, the Betty Watch or something. It's like the authorities watching them. They're also watching you. Seeing you as this beautiful star that you truly are. So is your divine counterpart. They like it. They see. They're coming in. You're going to have a reason to celebrate. Okay. They're, you're very strong and powerful. There's something about a Leo that's under heavy judgment. From what they did to you. And you're getting ultimate wish fulfillment. And these idiots are all fighting. There's another Leo. They're all fighting about you coming into union. You have this. Your cup overflowing with love. And you're, you know, you're very creative, you're very fertile, they're fighting over your creativity and your fertility, and, you know, you come in, giving this look 10-10, this completion's the end of a cycle, it's a painful permanent ending to somebody holding on to you, stealing this inheritance that did not belong to them, it belongs to you, you're getting it. They're in deep emotional pain because you're going to get a message, okay, maybe from the King of Pentacles, um, about this being a completion to end of a cycle, and it's because you walked away and you're staying in your power, all right? You're moving away, and your move is protected, too. The devil is even protecting you. Okay, they're trying to do some sort of destiny swap. It's not happening. They're grief, pain, sorrow, agony, whatever they're fucking losers. All right, guys, please hit that like button. If you're not Cormac, please hit that like button. Let's see how many Cormac, many Cormac things I got to watch on my channel. Um, uh, But, yeah, to those of you that are not Cormac, please hit that button, the like button, if you're not. And um, please hit share. Oh, wait, 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 wait duh, what am I doing? Um. Please spread love, not hate always. Don't please not forget to give to, to, to give God, Jesus, angels, ancestors, the ones that passed away, the utmost love, respect, gratitude, and appreciation. Because we're moving out in force, getting ready to rain down miracles on us, all right? And um, yeah. Now, now hit the like button. <laughs> Sorry. Now please hit the like button. Please hit share. If you like to share, please hit subscribe and turn that notification bell on to all so you can always be updated whenever I put another message out there for you guys. And if you like the news, not happy, it's not a requirement, but it is truly appreciated. The information is in the description box down below. And thank you from the bottom of it with all of my heart to the time to anybody and everybody who chooses to do so. <laughs> May God bless your beautiful souls tenfold. And even for the, um, thank you for the, uh, super thanks as well. Thank you, thank you, thank you. God bless your beautiful souls tenfold. Alright guys, have a good day. Have a good night. God bless.